Let's move on. Now, the governor of uh, Punjab, uh, retired uh, General S SF uh, Rodrigues, has lashed out at two ministers, Ambika Soni and Pavan Bansal. He says they are trying to frame him for corruption. The Central Village, uh, Vigilance uh, Commission has uh, ordered a CBI investigation into irregularities in two projects in Chandigarh. Rodrigues says his name has been taken only to settle old scores. The Punjab governor in the eye of a storm after the Central Vigilance Commission ordered a CBI probe into alleged irregularities in two mega projects. He has trained his guns at union ministers Ambika Soni and Pavan Bansal, alleging that they are trying to frame him in a case of corruption to settle old scores. SF Rodriguez says when he became governor in 2004, land allotment for a new school in Chandigarh was being investigated. On the board of that proposed school was Pavan Bansal, then a sitting MP, and Ambika Soni. And then in early 2006, there was a letter that came casting doubt on the way the Delhi public school allotment was made. Now, when this came up, I was worried because I said this is going to be a huge embarrassment because Pawan Bansal and Ambika Soni were both vice chairpersons. Mr. Soni was the chairperson and the family or the children were directors. And when I sent for the file, I realized that there was no way I could justify the allotment. And I told him, I'm sorry, the rules have been violated across the board. So he ordered the resumption of that land. That, Rodriguez alleges, became a point of bitter rivalry between him and Bansal. When Rodriguez was nominating Chandigarh corporators, Bansal complained to the high command alleging Rodriguez was anti-UPA. Then I did write to him that Chandigarh was like a global city designed by a famous French architect, La Carbusier. And before we do anything to change his plans, we should have a discussion and a debate involving the citizens of Chandigarh. He didn't seem to agree with me, but lots of people did. Recently, Bansal alleged that the Chandigarh administration under Rodriguez had leased out 100 acres of land arbitrarily to two builders below market rates. Sources say for both sides the timing is crucial as the governor's term ends in November and he might be hoping for a second term. With Vikram Chaudhary in Chandigarh, Saurabh Gupta for NDTV.